Okay, so we have a problem in hand. We are told that Shamal, let's say Shamal, is twice as old as Rhea. So Shamal's age is two times that age of Rhea. So let's say the present age of Rhea is X years. Then because Shamal is twice as old as Rhea, so it has to be 2X. Okay, that's what we get from the first part of it. 10 years ago, his age was four times that of Rhea. Now, what will be the age of Rhea 10 years ago? If she is today X years old, then 10 years ago, her age will be X minus 10. Because she was 10 years younger vis-a-vis -vis what she is today. And similarly, Shamal, who is 2X today, would be 2X minus 10 years old. Right? But we also know that 10 years ago, his age, whose age? Shamal's age. What was Shamal's age 10 years ago? Is 2x minus 10. Was 4 times that of Rhea. So, whatever his age was 10 years ago, which is 2x minus 10, this was equal to 4 times Rhea's age. So, 4 times, what was Rhea's age at that point in time? Her age was? x minus 10. So now we have, what we have done is that we have represented this statement in the form of an equation, a linear equation. And from here everything becomes simple. So we get 2x minus 10 is equal to 4 into x will give me 4x, 4 into minus 10 will give me minus 40. Once I have x on both the sides, what I do is, I transpose these two numbers. So I get 4x here and I move this 2x to the right hand side. As I move this, the sign will change. So this plus 2x becomes minus 2x is equal to minus 10. So I had minus 10 on this side and I move this minus 40 to the left hand side. So this will change sign. Solving this equation, 4x minus 2x gives me 2 times x is equal to 40 minus 10 or 30, which means that x, if I have to put it x here, I divide both the sides by 2. So, x is equal to 15. So, the present age of Rhea is 15 and Shamal is 2 times x is equal to 30. Now let's see if this other part is also true. So 10 years ago, what was the age of Sham? It was 30 minus 10 or 20. And 10 years ago, the age of Rhea was 15 minus 10 is equal to 5. Now we see that Shamal's age is 4 times the age of Rhea. And therefore, this mathematical equation holds true. 